What's up guys, not Super Mario here and welcome to today's video. It is here, The Last of Us Part 2 Official Story Trailer. This game in the last week went through a hell in my opinion and I think in a lot of people's opinion. I am so excited for this game. It's been pushed a couple of times but I've been confident and put a lot of faith into people who are uh, developing and making this game Naughty Dog of course that this is gonna be amazing because I think the first one is the best story based game ever made in my opinion. I think it's phenomenal, flawless, it is incredible. And yet, controversies happen and leaks happened. I've seen the leaks. Am I happy that I've seen them? No, I'm not. Do I think it ruins the, the whole experience now when I'm still gonna play this game? Yeah, maybe a bit, but I think People, not that they're overreacting, but to assume and say that the game is now ruined because you've seen something that happens that you don't like story-wise, I think you're stupid. I'm sorry, but you are. How can you say something is stupid and dumb because that and you haven't played it or you haven't seen it in in a context or what kind of a purpose is in the story? Maybe at the end it really doesn't work and it's bad but you cannot say that it's dumb decision basing on, it's your opinion, you can say it, of course, but how can you boycott the game and you decide that you're not gonna play it because you don't like the decision they made? I mean, it's their game, they can do whatever, it's not based on anything, it's not like it's based on a book or something, some previous thing, uh, and it's their game, their decision, their story, so they are allowed to do whatever they think is the best. Maybe it's not gonna work at the end, but I still wish that people would see this type of stuff like I'm seeing them. I, I think, yes, it's sad and it's bad that we've seen the footage, the leaks and everything. I'm not gonna say what the leaks are, I just avoid them. But to say that now the game is ruined, I think it's uh, too uh, pre presumptuous. Is that a word? Preemptively to say uh, because you haven't played it, you haven't seen it in a context, you haven't seen it in a game. So don't do that. If you want to play the game, play the game, and they'll the and then tell your opinion. It goes the same with Game of Thrones season eight. Did I like it? No but it was their story. There was no more books to base something that already existed and then make it in a TV show. Did I like it? No, I didn't. And what happened with this? It's sad because if you, whoever did it, because I don't know all the details, of course, because I was like, okay, I've seen the photos and the gameplay stuff. And I was like, no, no, no more. I, I don't care. I just want to want the game. It's sad. I think if you try to hurt the CEOs and the upper people who are in charge of everything, yes, you did, but you also hurt people who worked for years on this game and maybe for and maybe now this game is not going to be as successful as maybe it would be without these leaks. So whoever did it, I think it's sad. I think it's sad and just a dumb thing. To do even if they were trying to show how they're treating them because i don't know if it was an inside job or they were hacked you can tell me in the comments down below if you have any details on it but let's stop talking about these leaks i'm very very excited for this game i cannot wait to see how this story is gonna progress i want to see ellie i want to see joel i want to see all the other characters additional characters new characters maybe some surprises from the first game i cannot wait let's see this official story trailer I know you wish things were different. Oh, that's the first game. And that's a new game. I wish things were different. Ellie! Now everybody wishes that things were different because of the leaks. But they ain't. So it's kind of ironic. <laughs> Please 
I'm leaving tomorrow. To do this smart, we'd be leaving Jackson vulnerable. So they just get to get away with this? How'd you find us? You can't stop this. I want what you want. Jesus. But not at any cost. We could have killed you. <laughs> Maybe you should have. Nineteen of June. I like it. It looks awesome. It's dark. It's gritty. It is emotional. It it hits all the beats that you need for this sequel of an incredible game, in my opinion. And yet again, like I said at the beginning, if you want to play a game play a game and then decide what your opinion on it is. Because like I said, maybe at the end, I'm not gonna like the decision they made now that I already have some knowledge on, on what's gonna happen, but wait for the context, wait how the story progress and it makes sense. Maybe it's gonna work, maybe it doesn't. And it's gonna be, uh, because now that people know some big major spoilers, they're all, whoa, 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 what, what the heck? Maybe if they didn't know, they would be very surprised. And I'm, oh my gosh. So now Naughty Dog in this game is like in some conundrum, if that's even a word, that it's really hard to say how this game is gonna go uh, in success-wise, how people are gonna treat it, how many people are actually gonna pre-order it and play the game and or after. I think now because of the leaks and spoilers, I think a lot of people are gonna wait and purchase it after people say their opinion on it, the first people who play it. I'm playing it on June 19th, I don't care. This game is one of the best games, this franchise, the first game is the best game ever made in my opinion. And I'm so excited for this one. I'm sure it's gonna be awesome. Gameplay phenomenal. The story we will see. I still have high hopes that the story is good even with all the knowledge that we already have. But yeah, share opinion in the comments down below. What do you think? Are you gonna play this game even now that you know some stuff that are gonna happen? D do you even care that the leaks happened? And just leave your, share your opinion in the comments down below because I would really like to know your opinions on it. So yeah, that's gonna be it. If you enjoyed it, leave a like, hit the subscribe button, share this video all over the place, click that bell icon to get notified when I upload, and I see you next time. Bye!